So this is now day 13 of Illinois' uh, shelter in place. And up until now, it's been, our conversations have been a lot of, a lot of physicality. Um, but tonight, tonight I'm wanting to reflect on, on the emotional, uh, on the mental aspects of all of this. Um, it's kind of like uh, doing the physical work, but doing it in our mind. And a lot of it is we get so caught up in the hustle and bustle of everyday life that we we don't tend to work on the emotional aspects in our mind because we feel that we don't have time. Um, we put things off that we should be thinking about. We aren't dealing with feelings that need to be dealt with. And this is a perfect time to not not backpedal on our emotions, but to actually look at anything, whether it's family related, uh, work related, relationships, uh, your kids, um, uh, friends even. What emotional things during this quarantine can you work on, can we all work on to come out of this on the other side because there is going to come a time that a date is going to come and that we're going to get over this and we all want to come out of this better people so is there anything out there that maybe in your mind you're not dealing with um, it's one thing to cut the grass it's one thing to clean out your closet it's one thing to clean the room from top to bottom but are you cleaning out your mind our mind is the biggest room that we've got, ladies and gentlemen. And what are we really doing in this quarantine if we're not emotionally taking care of ourselves? If we're not really pouring our hearts into our mind? Too many times in daily living, we put things off because we say, well, I just don't have the time. Or there's not enough time to talk about it. There's not enough time to do anything about it. And we find ourselves kind of backpedaling our emotions and instead of actually dealing with the things that we want to do. This is a perfect opportunity in this quarantine, in this shelter in place. Even if you have to go to work, this is still a worldwide time in the history of our planet to really change our focus of reality and realize that Mental health and physical health need to go hand in hand to, to establish a successful life. So I just want to ask you, what, if anything, are you not handling? And I want to encourage you to handle it for yourself. Don't handle it for your kids. Don't handle it for a spouse. Handle it for you. Because your happiness is what matters the absolute most. It's not... You can't have an effect on other people's happiness. Because if you... There was a saying, you cannot infect the world with happiness if you have no happiness with inside yourself to infect it with. It's kind of hard to pour a cup of coffee if there's no coffee in the, built, in the jug, right? So I just want to encourage you today, take the time during this quarantine when you get done with some of your physical things that we've kind of talked about and just sit down and work on the mental aspects. Uh, come full circle and uh, have a great day and let's get through.